Hello children, this is Sonia Nair and today we are going to learn the topic, the sentence in English grammar. Okay, so our topic is the sentence. Now any sentence are of four types. How many? There are four types types of sentences okay the first type of sentence is declarative sentences it is declarative declarative can be also known as statements okay declarative sentences it can be either positive or negative Okay, they are also named, known as statements. The second type of sentence, what we are going to learn is interrogative. What is it? It is interrogative sentences. So, the second type of sentence is interrogative sentences now the third type of sentences are known as imperative imperative sentences okay and the last the fourth type of sentences are exclamatory sentences so one by one we will be learning all these four sentences and will be doing few examples related to them okay so first is declarative sentences now when we talk about declarative sentences uh, we usually, uh, the simple uh, name for declarative sentence is already told to you people. We call it as statements. What do we call it as? We call it as statements. Okay. And the end punctuation mark of a declarative sentence is usually a full stop. A full stop. Okay. Now, when we uh, talk about interrogative sentences, the simpler name to understand a interrogative sentence would be questions. They will be in the form of questions. Okay. So, what is the simpler form of it? It would be a question form. Okay. And normally the end punctuation mark here will be a question mark. Okay. We call it as question mark. Okay. Now the third type of sentences is exclamation. Mostly the simpler name what we could uh, suggest here is any sort of commands or uh, what we say request. Commands or request. So, any sort of commands or request is a simpler form to understand what are inter imperative sentences, okay? And uh, the end punctuation of these would be either a full stop, either a full stop or exclamatory mark, exclamation, okay? And uh, the last uh, type of sentence, which is exclamatory sentences, the simpler name for it would be exclamations. Mostly when we see exclamatory marks, exclamations, we can term them as exclamatory sentences. And the end punctuation mark for them would be obviously an exclamatory mark. I hope you all must have understood the types of sentences. It is declarative sentences, interrogative sentences, imperative sentences and exclamatory sentences. 
डिक्लेरेटिव सेंटेंसेस आई दर पॉजिटिव और नेगेटिव दे आर स्टेटमेंट्स एंड यूजुअली एंड विद अ फुल स्टॉप इंटरोगेटिव सेंटेंसेस आर मोस्टली क्वेश्चंस एंड विद अ क्वेश्चन मार्क इंपेरेटिव सेंटेंसेस आर मोस्टली कमांड्स और रिक्वेस्ट एंड एंड यूजुअली विद अ फुल स्टॉप और मे बी एक्सप्लेमेटरी मार्क ओके एंड एक्सप्लेमेटरी सेंटेंसेज आर मोस्टली एक्सप्लेमेशन and end with a exclamatory marks okay so we'll quickly see few examples so that we can uh, bifurcate which type of sentences are we talking about okay if i give you an example that is amazon is a river which type of sentences it will be which type of sentence it is it is a declarative sentence i'll just write a short form of it right because it's a proper statement ending with a full stop right okay give me the remote it is a command give me the remote so when i say this is a command so it has to be imperative sentence right if i give you a sentence like uh, say uh when is your birthday when is your birthday and this is a question asked so if it is a question then it should be interrogative sentence correct okay if i ask you uh, if i give you a statement say like uh, what a fine necklace jenny has so this is a exclamation okay this sentence is a exclamation so definitely it should be a exclamatory sentence so i hope hope you people are understanding so any simple sentence may be positive or maybe it's a negative sentence it should be a declarative sentence any command or a request like let's go home now there's a request right or if i say don't move now this is again a command so it has to be imperative sentences i'll give you a few example of declarative uh, sentence more like uh, our grandfather lives in mumbai so this is a simple statement with a full stop so it is it is a declarative sentence charles dickens was a famous british novelist so this is again a declarative sentence if i uh, give you a sentence like uh, was kapil the captain of our team question mark so this is a interrogative sentence who left the door open question mark so this is a interrogative sentence what a genius ramanujan was so this is a exclamatory sentence how clever the king's ministers are again a exclamation so it's a exclamatory sentence so i hope uh, you people must have understood the types of sentences so there are four types of sentences uh, now you all should uh, by now you all should remember them the names so it's declarative sentences okay imperative sentences interrogative sentences and exclamatory sentences okay so i hope you all must have understood this video uh, thank you so much for uh, listening to this uh, video and uh, hope you people must have understood each and everything explained thank you take care all